Have you ever wondered what's the difference between an automatic backwashable filter and a cartridge type filter? Well, I'm going to explain the difference right now. Hi, I'm Gary the Water Guy. I own the Water East Store and the Water Store in Midland. If this is your first time to my YouTube channel, welcome. I appreciate you watching my video. We want to click the link at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. That's our subscribe button. It'll take you right to our YouTube channel. We've got hundreds of water treatment videos, everything from how to install, how it works, how to maintain, etc. I'd also really encourage you to watch this video right to the end. I'm going to have a link to my uh, playlist on backwashable filters. Again, great information for you and your family. A cartridge type water filtration system is one like this, where a cartridge is put inside a filter housing like this guy here. This is a 20 inch big blue housing, so it's a whole house type setup. So whatever cartridge goes in here, it, uh, it can accomplish a different goal. For example, this is a sediment filter, so it removes particles from the water. You might use a filter like this um, because you do have a lot of dirt in your water and it might be clogging up that those dirt particles might clog up your washing machine or other uh, fine screens within your household. Or you might have an ultraviolet disinfection system system where you want to kill the bacteria in your water and you need a 5 micron pre-filter like this one here to accomplish that goal. So an alternative to that is an automatic backwashing filter. So that's what this one is here. So there's a media inside here that as the water flows through, the, the filtration that this does, in other words, removing the particles from your water, get trapped in, inside, the, the fil inside the media. But the beauty of this kind of a system is that once a week or whatever it's programmed for, it backwashes, so it cleans itself. Whereas in, in a, a sediment type filter, all the dirt particles are housed in this filter, filter cartridge. Once the cartridge is full, then it stops your water flow. Where this one is self-cleaning, so it cleans itself. But you can, you can use them in, in similar situations. You can put a, car, a carbon filter inside here to remove chemicals from your water, herbicides, pesticides, chlorine, that kind of thing. Again, you can get a carbon automatic backwashing filter that does exactly the same purpose. Um, you can put in a calcite filter, for example. If you want to raise the pH of the water, you can put a, a, a cartridge inside here. Um, and the same, you can get an automatic backwashing uh, calcite filter. That's also an option. Will an automatic backwashing filter filter down as fine as the, the cartridges? No, it won't. So if you have a five mic, if you need it for an ultraviolet light, for example, you need a five micron pre-filtration pre um, system for that ultraviolet light. Uh, you won't get an automatic backwashing filter down close enough to five microns. So you'd have to use this to do the heavy lifting and then you'd use a smaller five micron filter just to do that final filtration before the ultraviolet light. And by the way, we also offer free shipping and discount pricing on our full line of automatic backwashing filters. Just click the link up here. It'll take you right to our e-commerce store. Check it out today. And that's it. If you like what you saw today, please click the subscribe button if you haven't already. For some more information about the products we discussed, you can go to our websites, either thewateristore.com or thewaterstoremidland.com. And that playlist about the backwashable filters is right up here. Just click the link. It'll take you right there. You can check out those videos for a lot more information. And that's it for me, Gary the Water Guy. Thanks for watching.